with a handful of announcements. The first one is um, we're very happy and grateful to say that Carol Christ has left us a bequest um, for the Women's Spirituality Graduate Studies Program at CIIS. It will be the Carol P. Christ Lectureship and Scholarship Fund for Goddess Studies and Ecofeminist Social Justice Studies. And so at CIIS in the Women's Spirituality Graduate Studies Program, this is how we will be carrying on the legacy of Carol Christ's work in the world moving forward. The next slide. And if you want to learn more about the two graduate degrees that we offer at CIIS, we have a PhD in philosophy and religion that concentrates on women's spirituality and an MA in women, gender, spirituality, and social justice. Um, and you can find us on Facebook and like us, please. And a YouTube channel holds more about us. You can reach all of this through the CIS website, www.cis.edu. And next, we want to talk, well, we want to tell you about um, the, what Laura just mentioned, that Carol's book, Odyssey with the Goddess, um, A Journey to the Goddess in Crete, has been republished now and is available with the new title, A Serpentine Path, Mysteries of the Goddess. And this has been published by Goddess Inc., a very fine women's spirituality publishing house. Uh, that you can find online, and the book will be available through Amazon. And next, we have um, a, more information about the fact that the Ariadne Institute, with Laura's leadership, is going to be holding an online memorial gathering. Um, Laura and Ellen Bonaparte and um, Tina Nevins uh, did a memorial service for Carol shortly after she died. And that's uh, offered up on feminism and religion and we made it available as a resource that you can return to. Uh, but they will be having an open online Zoom memorial gathering for Carol on her birthday, December 20th of this year. And so you can go and it'll be a place to, again, honor and remember Carol and um, speak about um, our love for Carol and our appreciation of how much she has offered us in the world. And these international people have given us the time in Pacific Standard Time, Eastern Standard Time for the UK and then for Greece. But you can find it um, by going to Ariadne Institute. I think it's easier. I'm not going to read out this website for you, this URL, but that is going to be December 20th coming up, a memorial service for Carol. And then we also want to tell you about um, the Goddess Pilgrimage to will continue. Laura Shannon will be inviting people to walk in the footsteps of Carol, and they're planning um, the next pilgrimage for next fall, the first two weeks of October, and then the following year, that's 2022, and then the following year, um, the last two weeks of September 2023. And again, you can find that information at goddessariadne.org or um, online. And there's one more slide, I believe, uh, to remind you or to, to give you the details about the feminism and religion blog. Um, and there, a collective tribute to Carol has been put up there by Sochito Alviso. Uh, a tribute to Carol, but it's open and anyone can go there and um, express their appreciation for Carol, tell their stories there. It's open um, and you're welcome to go there and write about um, what you would, whatever you'd like to say about Carol. And then there's the Arthur, author archive of Carol's blogs are also there at feminismandreligion.com. Lastly, 
we want you all to know that these events have been recorded and will be available on our Women's Spirituality website in the near future, maybe two weeks from now. Hopefully everything goes well technically. And again, you can find us at, at the ciis.edu website under Women's Spirituality. So those are our, our announcements for the Carol Chris Legacy moving forward. And now Annette, Director of the Women's Spirituality Graduate Studies Program, will do a closing for us.